Number the seven. kicker's got the ball set up, and we're ready to get this thing started. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on their own 28. It's a 30-yard line. Third down. Mike 51. Mike 51. Ready. 180. And they make the stop at the 38. Not every offense uses their tight ends very effectively, but when they do, it can be a nightmare for a defense. From their own 38 yard line. It's first down. And he tackles him hard at the 41 yard line. The back gets three on the carry. The sophomore just stuck it to the ball carrier right there. That's a very good tackle. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Hey, Mike 51, Mike 51. Here we go. Green and he ain't. Green, 88. Ah. Fires out to his receiver. Brought down at the 48-yard line. From their own 48-yard line. Third down. You know, Brad, that's the second third down that they've been able to convert on this drive. And this offense right now has really showed a lot of poise to be able to hold on to the football and try to maintain this drive. He's at the 30, and he's taken down at about the 27-yard line. So with that run, they pick up another first. Just a nice job again up front by the offensive line. They're doing a good job of neutralizing the defensive front, and it's allowed them to move the ball down the field. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Tackle made around the 27-yard line. No game. No that, that makes it second, second and ten. ten. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 27. Three down, three down. 51, Mike. Mike 51. Set. Wide Check, eight. check. Stingray. Stingray. And he's tackled at the 14. They pick up a few yards there on the pass. And I'll tell you what, that fake handoff froze the secondary just enough to allow for the receiver to come up with a nice gain that time. Good call. He's taken down at the three-yard line. Well, that's another first down, Brad. That's the fifth first down on this drive. You know, they're, they're, this offense isn't hitting a lot of big plays, but they're very, very consistent with their execution. It's putting a lot of pressure right now on this defense. Touchdown, USF! He makes the PAT. It was an 11-play, 72-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. So our score, 7-0. South Florida ready to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. 
This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Blazers and their ground game's always been sensational. It's not always one guy, Herbie. Sometimes they've got two or three that can carry the load. And that's what makes it so tough for this defense is you're not focusing in on just one guy. You're focusing in on really an entire scheme. And because of that diversity, I think it makes it more of a challenge. And you got to be better tacklers in the open field. And, and I think that's really what they've stressed all week is tackling and gang tackling and getting to the football. It's hard to get to guys and make tackles with space. From their own 26 yard line. It's second down. Mike, Mike 34, Mike 34. Ready! Ready! Cut. Just throws this one away. Great job by the defense at getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. Take four, take four. Mike 34, Mike 34. Scoop, yeah. scoop, scoop. And he is drilled at the 21. You know, Brad, that time the defense brought the blitz, and I think it confused the offensive line. It's one thing to pick up the blitz, but you also have to be accountable for the defensive lineman, and that time the lineman got to the quarterback and came up with a sack. These special teams have done it before, blocking punts. It looks like they're coming after this one. And down he goes at the 47. The last time we saw this offense on the field, they drove the length of the field. And you think back to what that defensive coordinator tried to do. He tried to change some things up, but nothing seemed to work. It's going to be interesting to see how he can have an impact on this drive. Well, you can really mess with an offense's game plan if you can take away their ability to run. That'll bring up second and 11. From their own 45-yard line, it's second down. South Florida is up by a touchdown. Gets it out quickly. They'll bring him down right around the 40. Ten to go. Ball on the 40-yard line. Quick throw to the tight end, and down he goes at the 35. That's a game of five on the way. That'll make it 35. From the 35 yard line, it's third down. Hey, Mike 51, Mike 51. Ready! Green 90! Green 90! Motion, motion, motion! Cut! Quick pass. That's a great tackle at the 18. Looks like we're going to have a good game on our hands after one. 7 0. Bull. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. And he can't get away from the pressure. Boy, Brad, that was a big Losses hit on the quarterback. we will be interested to see how he responds from this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive lineman and challenges them to start playing a little bit better. So that sack sets him back a little bit now. They're looking at second and 13. South Florida is up seven. Ready! Green 19, cut! Gains his way to the 13-yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. Here's the 
was the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. That'll be a two-yard gain. Wasn't a huge gain here, but at least you know as a quarterback that when you throw to this senior, you're putting the ball into some sure hands. They're going to go for the easy three here. South Florida can make this a two-possession game with this field goal, and it sails through the uprights. They line up to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. He makes it to the 15-yard line. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. He's tackled at the 29. First, down. First, down. First and ten. Ball on their own 29. Three down, three down. 86 to me, 86 to me. Has some daylight. Great concentration to haul it in. And they make the stop around the 49-yard line. The quarterback did an excellent job of recognizing the Mike linebacker on the blitz. He hung in there, delivered the pass, and his receiver made a good catch to move the sticks. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 49. He's on the run. Right down at the 44. That'll bring up second and three. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. He makes it out to maybe the 43 yard line. They're not quite in field goal range, so this is a pretty important play on this drive. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. From the 34-yard line, first down. And he hits him hard at the 21-yard line. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. Hey, check back 34. Mike, 34. Hey, green, 19. He makes it to the 18-yard line. And this play is number eight on the drive. Four down, four down. Watch 35, watch 35. 34 is the fight. 34 is the He makes it to the 15 yard line. They're about four yards away here on third down. Tackled right away. Good gain on the pass to the running back. This young man is becoming more and more part of this passing game. He does a great job of making guys miss after the catch. Pressure coming and the ball is loose. The defense scoops it up. So the offense turns over the pigskin. The ball carrier here was just careless in handling the ball. And a great awareness by the defense to jump on it. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Lost the ball, fumble, and the offense picks it up, and they got him for a loss.
Defense looking for another three sack down, in the down. second down and long situation. Three down, three down. They're packed in tight on the line. Ready! 180. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. He just never had a chance to get any running room. The defense was on him almost as soon as the ball was snapped. Third down. Tough spot here, deep in their own territory. Makes it out to about the 13. The defense here gives some yards up, but they do set up a fourth down. But that's one of those plays where you got to be very careful. That's a big gain by the offense on the ground on third down and long. Brought down at the 50. The Blazers know, I think, that at some point they just have to do what they do, even if it's not working right now. If they can get it going in the second half, it should really improve the ball game and the offense. Well, the offensive line, I think, also has to be accountable here. Uh, we look so much to our star players, and we always want them to put up big numbers. But to me, the two go hand in hand. When a running back's going to have a great game, the offensive line deserves some credit. When a running back's struggling, you got to look at that offensive line and say, fellas, you got to help me out. We're not going to change or deviate from this game plan. We need to be able to change this game around, and it starts up front with the offensive line. They'll make the sack. Quick strike to the receiver. And he's taken down around the 46-yard line. So they're going to go for it here. So we've played two quarters. USF leads it 10-0. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Bruce Davis, Dave Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. This team accomplished one great thing in the first half. They did? They got all of their internet boards a buzzing. They got social media going crazy. They got the let's fire the coach mob out there after them one more time. But I'll tell you, they put themselves in a hole, and if they don't stop digging, it's going to it's gonna end badly for this team. Well, we, we talk about the motivation factor every single week. It, now you better get motivated. Now you got no choice. You spotted them a couple touchdowns. You're down by two possessions. Obviously, your attitude has to change. Coach's attitude has to change. You have to be more aggressive. But there's, there's no overlooking this squad now. It's now or never. First possession, third quarter, you either got to get a stop or you got to score some points. It's huge to start the second half. Don't let this lead get out of hand early because then you're going to be looking around going, well, see what happened was just about set to start the second half. What are you looking for? I'm looking to see which team has that decided schematical advantage. And if they can find it, they'll blow holes three or four axe handles wide. Brad and Kirk will be there to call the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. The Bulls continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Throws and it's knocked away. That was a nice, nice play to close on the ball like that. You can't teach that kind of reaction. It's just natural ability. From their own 16-yard line, second down. Heading for the corner. Big opening. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. Even if you're pulling for the other team, you've got to just admire this guy's speed. He is special. Man left, man left. Three down, 
three down. Mike 34, Mike 34. Scoop, scoop, hey, hey. Black 85. Straight ahead on the given. There's nowhere to run. From their own 35 yard line. Second down. Wears it out to the right to the halfback. Tackle made at the 45 yard line. Number nine on the tackle at the 45 yard line. That'll make it 31. Four down, four down. Hey, check back 34. Mike 34. Let's go. Black 90. On the run. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Gain of four yards. First down. From their own 49 yard line. First down. 34 is the mic. 34 is the mic. Ready. Quick shot to the tight end, and he can't pull it in. These guys, especially in the secondary, really get after it and can make life hard for the play callers on the other side of the ball. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. Not a real fancy play here, just a smartly run route. Good protection and a well-placed ball. Most times, you don't need much more than that. So they're going to try to determine if the receiver had possession and was inbounds or not. After, After review, review of the play, play the, ruling the ruling on the, on the field, field stands. stands. Well, I think the play warranted a review, but the call on the field stands. Here's the eighth play of the series. Four down, four down. Mike 34, Mike 34. Scoop, scoop, scoop. Yeah. Red 18. Red. Red, 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 red. Decent run here, right side. That's good for a game of five yards. That brings him second and five. It's second down, five to go. Ball on the 32. They just took what the defense gave them on that play. Yeah, you're right. That was a good job of getting that pass completed for positive yardage. This is the 10th play of this drive. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. First down grab by the receiver. He's taken down at the 23. First and 10. Ball on the 23. Hey, watch number five. Number five. Watch number five. 34. Black 90. And they get nice yardage on that run. That makes it Here's the 12th play of the drive. And let's see if the third time's a charm down here in the red zone. Nice run, and he's brought down. They've been two for two on third downs in this drive, and they'll try to convert again here. Makes it to the 12-yard line. Call it a gain of two yards. Here's play number 14 of this drive. Four down, four down. 34 is the mic. 34 is the mic. He's coming. Check him. Check him. Let's go. Black. He goes out of bounds. The nine-yard line. Second down and seven. Nine yards to the goal line. He's tackled at about the 11. And this is the 16th play of the drive. They come out in a five wide set. A little toss across the middle. They'll bring him down around the four yard line. This isn't much more than an extra point.
It's up, and it is good. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So you wonder what kind of excitement we'll see this time around. South Florida is up a score. Now he's scrambling, and they got it. I think that one's on the offensive line. They've got to do a better job of holding their blocks, or else this quarterback's going to be pulling turf out of his face mask all game. Looking to dig themselves out of a little hole here after the sack. It's second and 14. Mike 51, Mike 51. Set, wide 80, wide 80. Motion, motion, motion. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterback's just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. So they couldn't pick up the long yardage, and now they'll have to punt. The offense really had nowhere to go on that one. The play was very well defended, and now the incompletion will force the fourth down and a punt. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard line. I think this defense has played well enough to be able to win this game, obviously. But at some point, you'd love to see their own offense feed off of some of the confidence that their defense is playing with. Because up to this point, the defense is keeping them in the game. The offense isn't quite doing enough to be able to build on that lead. And down he goes around the 43-yard line. That makes it second. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. And now he's got room to run. He gets hit out of bounds at the 22. We're headed to the fourth quarter, and both of these defenses are still stealing the show. The Bulls lead 10-3. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Three down, three down. Three down, three down. 34's the mic, 34's the mic. He's coming, check him, check him. Here he goes. Inside the 10. Huge play, and it's going to be first and goal. He really showed some good speed there. I'll tell you, no question. When you talk about being able to turn on the Jets and leave everybody in the dust, you have to mention this young man. He's got skills, but his speed is what the pro scouts are drooling about. Well, this is it. They've got all four downs to get in the end zone. They line up in the jumbo set. Tackle at the eight-yard line. He gets rid of this one. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. It's third down. They need eight yards here to get the ball in the end zone. Dumps it complete to the halfback over the middle. Scrambling around, and he's going to run this one in. Touchdown. What a touchdown. He didn't see anyone open, so he just took it in himself. This quarterback is fearless, and the defense needs to either spy him or walk the safeties up when they've got the ball down near the goal line. 
They'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So that's a seven-play, 50-yard drive. And the result, seven points. And the big plays that they had running the football were the keys to that drive. And a 10-10 tie in this game. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. And you know, it's basically like we're starting from zero here in a one-quarter game now. Every possession is vital. And they got him. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush because sacks can be real drive killers. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. Steps out of bounds around the 25-yard line. That brings us third and ten. He's to the 40. He makes the catch and has a first down. He's tackled at the 49. From their own 49-yard line. First down. Complete, but they didn't get much there. And that's because the defense was just waiting on it and they attacked. The quarterback should have found somebody else downfield. And once again, they'll come to the line trying to convert on third down. Just under three to go in regulation. Play fake and looking to run. And they make the stop at the 34. The 35. Number 10. Ten. 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 That'll bring up second and 11. Oh, man. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Three down, three down. Go. Mike, Mike, 51. Mike, 51. <laughs> He's going to try and scramble. And he's taken down right around the 28-yard line. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. And he's level at the 19. Tenth play of the drive. come out in a goal line set. Nice run to the left there. So it's second down now. They need about four yards to pick up the first. Up the middle for a nice game. This is the 12th play of this drive. Well, that's the end of regulation, and this game is still unsettled, so we're going to overtime. And here we are. We played four quarters, and we still don't have a winner, so we go to overtime. And he 
he's tackled right away. Game seven on the play. That'll bring up second and three. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. You're not going to be able to get by a short tackler like this linebacker too often. got a little ahead of the snap count. Here's the call. False start, start offense. offense. It'll be third down again after that penalty. Yeah, now they have more yards Still to pick up down. for the first down. Third down, and they need to get it to the 15. Well, I love the toughness here by this quarterback of sitting in until the last second trying to make a play downfield only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit, but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. And it sails to the uprights. I know they would have rather put the ball in the end zone, but this is still big. Points are points. I think their defense is going to thrive under the circumstances. From the 25-yard line, it's first down. 10-20, It looked like the quarterback thought he had an open receiver there, but I don't think he saw the linebacker. That makes it second and 10. Mike 51, Mike 51. Set, red 68, red 68. And they hit him in the backfield. Of three yards of That'll, That'll make, make it third, third and 13. From the 28 yard line, third down. Four down, four down. 51 Mike. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. And he shoved out of bounds around the 18 yard line. That's a game of 10 on the play. That brings up fourth and three. Kicks away, and it hits the upright. No good. This one's in the books, and our final score, UAB 13, South Florida 10. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.